How's it going, everyone? It is Prashan here. We have another Marvel Snap deck highlight. We have Red Guardian. He is the newest card in Marvel Snap. On reveal, afflict the lowest power card here with negative two power and remove its text. So I recently did a poll on my channel and it was mixed feelings about this card. It was basically 50, 50. I thought it was going to be better. I thought a lot more people were going to like this card or be into this card. I think it's better than Cosmo, in my opinion. It, it attacks cards that are ongoing instead of just on reveal. So cards like Mystique, Iron Man, and it affects like cards in the discard arena. If you were able to get him out early enough, it could afflict uh, Mobius and remove its text. It could afflict a Dracula and move its text because Dracula just stays one until the end of the game. So I, I think there's a place for Red Guardian. Um, I think he's just a tech card in a, a deck. So we'll play a basic deck. And let's see how Red Guardian goes, and and then we could we could give a a for sure for sure critique on Red Guardian if he's good or not. So let's uh, get into the deck. As always, remember like, subscribe, all that good YouTube stuff. Uh, this is the deck we have: Nebula, Yondu, Daredevil, Red Guardian, Baron Zemo, Gladiator, Shang Chi, Iron Lad, Professor X, Cannonball, She Hulk, and Red Hulk. So this is a mill lockdown deck sort of hybrid we want to mill away their smaller cards and then leave them with the big boys that way you could take them out with shang chi and cannonball towards the end or you could outpower them with your own red hulk and she hulk so that's pretty much it for the deck red guardian is here to take out cards that you don't need on the board uh like maybe a iron man dracula like stuff like that or you can even take out small stuff like nebula so if they put nebula in the lane and they think they could like set it and forget it you could just play red guardian on that nebula and she's done for the rest of the game she's just just depending on where she's at she could be like a negative one or she could be a one for the rest of the game and you don't have to worry about the nebula just sitting there collecting power so that is it for the deck uh yeah so let's get into the games. Let's let's get some doves. All right. So we have Shang Chi, Iron Lad, Baron Zemo, Sunspot. I'm gonna put Sunspot into the right. Uh, next we have Karmataj here. So nothing for us to play. I really like this hand with Karmataj. So they play Mindstone. People are still playing Thanos. I, re I really haven't seen Thanos that that much as of late. All right. So we play Baron Zemo middle. Reality Stone. Soul Stone, nice. We play Cosmo mid, and Cosmo's gone. Uh, turn four. So we do have Red Guardian. Um, I am gonna go Iron Lad, because Iron Lad could hit Red Hulk, Nebula, or Daredevil. And I, I think I like those choices. Okay, it is Daredevil, nice. So Squirrel Girl, turn five here. So they play Blue Marvel in the middle. Um. I think we play Cannonball, and then we play Red Guardian. Oh no, I, I totally messed that up. Um, <laughs> I messed that up. How many cards they have in their hand? Uh, deck three.
Um, I don't know. I think I messed this up. I think I messed this up. We'll play Red Guardian just for the heck of it. Oh, we still win. Well, that's interesting to see Red Guardian. But man, what I don't know, their math wasn't mathin', huh? Because what made them think a Thanos would have won there? They would have Yeah, it would have been tough for them either way. Alright, so we have Red Guardian, Shang Chi, She Hulk, and Nebula. Let's go ahead and play Nebula. Fisk Tower. Uh nothing to play. And we'll play Zemo. So they play Jeff. So do we snipe their Jeff right now? I'm going to snipe their Jeff. Let's uh, use Red Guardian and snipe Jeff. All right, turn four. Uh, let's go Baron Zemo. Yondu? All right, they play Mobius. Oh, come on. That, that sort of sucks. Turn five. Um, I am going to... What's Professor X mid? Why do they have Bast in this deck? So you play Blue Marvel. Man. Man, oh man. Do we play Shang-Chi and Daredevil? So if we win Crown City, we win the game. So we got to win Crown City. <laughs> oh, man. Pretty nerve wracking. They retreat. Oh, my goodness. They retreat. <laughs> oh, man. So we have the raft as our first location. We have She-Hulk, Cannonball. Shang-Chi to start off. All right, they play Misty Knight. We have Death's Domain. Let's go Daredevil. All right, there's Mindscape, and we do have Professor X. So they play Cyclops. It's pretty scary. Let's go She-Hulk. They play Kyra. Let's see what they do here. So they play magic. Uh, we're going to go. 
Professor X. Turn six. Uh, let's go. I guess we could go Red Guardian. It affects Misty Knight. Red Guardian Gladiator. Final turn here. Um, I don't know. What do we do here? Did we go Red Hulk? They did have a Shang Chi, so we could have played anything else. We could have played Cannonball on one. All right, so we have Shang Chi, Red Guardian, Red Hulk, and Daredevil. They play Spider Ham and Shang Chi. Cloning Vats. Uh, let's go Daredevil to Mojo. They play cable. Best domain. Um, I don't know. Let's go gladiator. They go gladiator. They pull nebula or Yandu. They pull Yandu. Chung Chi's gone. We don't have to worry about him. All right, turn four. Um, let's go Nebula and Gladiator again. You play Magic. Baron Zemo takes. I think it takes Baron Zemo. So we have a uh, Professor X coming. So Cannonball. So this is winnable. We have Professor X. So they're going to play Dr. Octopus. Um. I don't know. Do I risk it? I'm going to play Iron Lad um, into Death's Domain. Hopefully, it's Professor X. They don't have Shang Chi. I took that out. Yes. All right, turn six. Um, I'm gonna go pig. Let's go pig. So they, they don't play anything. I should have locked it down. Um, I don't know, let's just go cannonball. So I'm guessing they play Red Hulk into Mojo and they have She-Hulk. But that's not enough.
Yeah, we got it. Perfect. Let's go. Victory. So we have Red Guardian, She-Hulk, Iron Lad, Atuma, and Professor X to start off. The Atuma and Professor X is going to be perfect. And then we get Red Guardian that Nova, and that Nova won't even go off. Alright, so I am going to put Professor X into the right. They go Deadpool. Alright, so turn three, I am going to play Red Guardian. And it's either going to hit the Nova or the Deadpool, which is perfect. Because Deadpool won't... Oh, they retreat! Oh my goodness, man. Oh my goodness. Maybe I should have held off on the Professor X. Alright, so we have Yondu, Daredevil, Iron Lad to start off. I'm going to go ahead and go Yondu. They play Nico. So this is straight up destroy. Uh, one energy this turn. Let's just go Daredevil middle. It's crazy. Like every destroy player has the destroy avatar, huh? Ooh, Carnage. So they have a lot of energy going into next turn. A lot of energy. And they have Luke's bar. Luke's bar, that's crazy. Uh, let's in turn. I can technically cannonball Luke's bar. If we need to. So Wolverine and Deathlock. They're running out of destroy stuff, right? They just have Venom left. Um, turn four. So let's. I'm gonna go She-Hulk. They play Death. I can possibly take the chance of playing. So, Hulkbuster. Let's go Red Guardian. All right, they have priority. Um, do we just Shang? Shang middle? They go Arnim Zola? Yep, Arnim Zola. Read you, read you like a book there, pal. Doesn't matter where the Wolverine. Yes, it does. It matters where the Wolverine goes. Oh, man. No, it doesn't. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Let's <laughs> go. Oh, man. All right. That is it for this video. I think Red Guardian is okay. Definitely a situational card. I. I think he can fit as a tech card in many decks. I would give him maybe, I don't know, three stars out of five. Maybe, maybe three stars. Maybe that's how he, he feels to me. So till next time, guys, be safe, keep on snapping, and peace.